Oh my god, it doesn't look that big. Okay, can I fly this? No way! What? Oh my god! What the heck, dude? This is so dope! Welcome everybody, this is Ron, and today we're gonna be playing Forge on PC. Now, what the hell is going on? Forge isn't supposed to be on PC yet. Well, there's actually a mod thanks to GameCheat13 posted on a new Reddit, Halo Mods, which I'll link down below. You can play Forge today, and we're going to be doing that. So as you can see, it's already baked onto the menu. It's actually super easy. At the end of the video, I'll be going through a little like a tutorial on how you guys can do this yourself. But let's go ahead and try out Forge World. So I think there's no boundaries. I don't know if the Thorge items are there, including like the Saber and stuff like that. And I heard that you actually have to use an Xbox controller too. Okay, uh, so how do we how do we go to Forge here? Um, I got my Xbox controller. Um, it is not. Oh, oh, it's now now it's working. Oh, there we go. Oh my God! Look at that budget. <laughs> wow. Okay, uh, is the Thorge items. But let's go ahead and uh, try out the uh, the no boundary thing. Let's see if that starts working. Wow, that budget. I think it's 10,000, the, the normal one. Wow, wow, what a liberating feeling this is to actually be able to just say, fuck you. I want to forge up here, bitch. Look, nothing's pushed me. Wow. Now this is forge, baby. This is what it always should have been. This is just unbelievable, guys. Like, we're... Oh my god, we're actually... We're actually going up here, man. Even, even when I did like uh, some mods back in the day, I, I I don't I I don't think I ever got this far. Wow. We can really just literally go anywhere we want now, can't we? I'm just wait. I'm just like waiting for me to blow up uh, and explode, you know. But it's not really happening. And uh, that's another thing. We're gonna see terrible textures. <laughs> And look at that massive green field right there. That's like a whole nother, like, fucking continent, you know? It's like a whole nother place you can forge on. And look at that. Look, have you ever seen Forge World look so small before, guys? Ladies and gentlemen, this is just unbelievable. Thanks, GameCheat13 and, and anyone else responsible for, for making this happen so quickly. They may have already done it. Why don't we go ahead and fly around uh, a Banshee? Okay, let's take a look at the... We need structure. Oh! Oh! Oh my god! There it is, baby! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I just need a platform. Oh, oh my god, I'm being pulled back. Okay, there's a catch right there. Oh my god, we're gonna fly the saber, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go ahead and set this down. Let's go ahead and get down here real quick. Can I fly this? No way! What? Oh my god! <laughs> What the heck, dude? This is so dope. Holy shit. Yo, bro. What? Are you fucking kidding me? I am in a fucking saber right now on Forge World. Jesus Christ. Look, I'm flying over here. Can you imagine little fucking base fights and shit, man? Oh, my God. Unlimited budget. Oh, I still have a... I still have a cap my thruster heat. I forgot about that. Can I, uh... Can I twirl? How do I twirl? Oh, there we go. Left bumper. Uh, can I can I get out right here? Is this even? Yeah. Okay, that's what I think. Oh, I died. <laughs> we got warthog transport. We got what other vehicles? We have falcons. Oh man, I wish I had. I wish I had one friend to help me fly this. Can I operate the turret? Wow. Oh shit, son! Look at that destruction. <laughs> Oh my god, baby! Yes! Holy fuck! I, uh, I don't think I ever got to fly the Seraph, because I, I, I know Bungie made it where you could fly the Seraph. Man, I can't wait for Saber and Seraph fights and, uh, in multiplayer matches, man. That shit can already ha Oh, oh god! You know, that's what's really unbelievable about this, is, is, is everything's really- I mean, it, the whole world is our oyster now, and, and that's why I've been saying Halo needs to come to PC. You see that right there, guys? That's all of Forge World. Bank right there, that's that's the entire Forge World. And look how much space we got to play in. I mean, there's all these like distant mountains and skyboxes. There's even the Halo Ring, which I think is like its own layer on the map. And uh, I wonder if we can go up like to the clouds. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, we got a friend that just joined. He may have been one of the giveaway winners, but uh, I wonder if he'll just get kicked out. Um. I know it's not as fun, but let's take a look at the tree. Ooh. 
Oh, he says, I'm sorry to bother you, but is the is the cross platform? What? I'm sorry, I feel like I'm not going through this fast enough, but um Electric cart we get to drive these? Oh my god, baby. <laughs> Oh my god, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I can't believe this meme is actually like a thing now. Holy fucking hell. Man, this thing's got crazy drift, bro. Not this fucking thing, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh shit, dude. Oh my god, I'm driving this huge ass fucking truck on Forge World. But will I be able to get over this hill? Because I got... Where's the turbo on this thing? It's this a new vehicle here. Let's see what what does this do? Oh wow, those are those are big hits right there. Now I don't think these are flyable. These yeah, look they're phasing through stuff. But you know, I mean, how long does it? I mean, how long is that gonna take? <laughs> right? I mean that's gonna be like two days. The Phantom's gonna be flyable. So is a Pelican, I'm sure. Um, I think these are sceneries. Yeah, vehicles. Oh look at that. Now how hard is that, Bungie? Just Putting a pelican in, in Forge, just as an object, at least. That's cool. By the way, how do you get out of the saber safely? Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can, like, survive getting off this thing. If I wanted to land right there, how would I do that? I could slow down. Actually, this thing goes pretty slow. Oh, God, it starts speeding up, though, when you jump out. <laughs> oh, fuck. Take note of, um... Take note that everything costs zero dollars? And that everything says it's zero amount. So that is basically acting like unlimited. So um, how do I, how do I, was duplication in this yet? I don't think duplication was here yet, was it? Um, anyway, this is a cool new object here. Oh man, there's just like a lot. I'm, you know, one thing I'm really tempted to do is like to build like a spaceship, tons of sabers and seraphs fighting each other, doing one flag or one bomb or something. But I feel like that's kind of, that's what everyone is going to do. That's what everyone's going to do. It's going to be like... Also, new armor abilities. I can't wait for that, Mom. Essentially, you can spawn as much stuff as you possibly want. Also, I wanted to just kind of fly around a little bit more. Just really scope out this 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 large green field here. Now, it doesn't... I doubt it'll look pretty. All right. Also, look at this ocean here. This is a nice little ocean here. I mean, just lots, lots of water to forge on. Now... I really w would like for someone to update Forge World. Um, wow, you know that grass doesn't look that bad actually. Oh, oh my God! And and it's actually it's got a it's got a boundary on it. No way, no way, no way, no way here. I'm gonna land right here. I'm gonna get out, and then it starts going fast again. And off we know. Now, what would be really cool is for like there to be like a little fort right here, and then like the attackers have uh, access to all the to all these sabers and stuff and they're attacking them, you know? Okay, to do this is actually incredibly easy and I'm reading a tutorial by the Informer420 on the Halo Mods Reddit, which is a new Reddit, by the way. I'll leave that link down below and if you wanna see the post yourself, but I'm gonna talk about how to do it. First, you need to download HXD and I'll leave a link down to that below. It's a hex reader, it's totally safe. No virus or anything you need to worry about. So you install that and then you open it up after you've installed it. You want to launch it, right? And then you want to go to Steam Apps Common Halo Master Chief Collection and then go to MCC Content Packs MCC Windows No Editor dot pack. Now, I would make a backup of this and I think you have to switch it out before you go into standard multiplayer again. I'm not actually quite sure, but you do certainly want to make a backup. But if you don't, you can just do the opposite of what I'm about to tell you to do here. So in HXD, what you want to do is press Control G, not Control F, but Control G, and type in this code exactly as you see as hex, which is the default one, and then search it. And then your cursor will be selected on one single line, a zero, zero line. So you want to change that to 27. Then press Control G again, but this time search for now, this code, again, as hex. So, again, you want to do the same thing. Change the 00 to a 27. And then save the file. And I think it'll create, like, a backup thing that should only take uh, 30 seconds to 40 seconds. Now, what you need to do, lastly, is go to this Mega Upload by GameCheat13. And you need to download it. It's about 300, 400 megabytes large. 
and then that has a forge map file okay so what you're gonna want to do with that map file is you're gonna want to go back to the master chief collection folder here the directory and then you're gonna want to go to halo reach maps all right not map variants maps and then you're gonna want to replace the forge map now Again, you want to back up forge under underscore halo dot map. What I did was I just went to the directory and I made a backup folder that has both my forge halo map and the Windows No Editor MCC thing. So you can even type down maybe notepad where the directories are. But and after you do that, it's pretty straightforward. You need to launch Halo MCC as anti-cheat disable, the second option, not the first. And then you're going to see on the main menu, you're going to see create and then forge and then Halo reach. And then you're going to be able to forge, baby. That's pretty much all that there is to do do uh pretty much that's it and the last thing is have fun um again yeah you know be careful because you don't want to like look like a hacker or anything so uh, make sure you like replace those files before you go back online i think that's what you need to do i'm not quite sure honestly but i would do it just to be safe guys uh this is really really cool we got forge already uh, as a mod and uh make sure to bring a controller too <laughs> uh, what I did was I just plugged a uh, USB with uh, my controller into my computer and it, it, it took a couple seconds for it to load up but after that I was able to use it with no problem uh, of course it was an Xbox One controller I don't know about other controllers uh, or PS4 controller I don't know about that but anyways guys let me know what you think about all this <laughs> down in the comments below check out Halo Mods Reddit by the way and uh, I'll be covering more mods in the future this was really fun and uh, I hope everything goes over smoothly in your installation of Halo Reach's Forge. <laughs> day one mod. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, maybe day two. All right. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one. Uh, be sure to subscribe too and like this video up if you ended up enjoying. And I'll catch you guys in the next one soon. Peace.